For, for a lot of Americans right now, this inflation has been crushing. They were already struggling a little bit, and now the cost of goods has gone up so much that it's really making it tough. So we have to look at two things. We have to look at income, cash flow is king. So for a lot of people, it means we're gonna have to do things we don't wanna do, like get a second job. And there are jobs available. This is the one thing about this current recession that we're in, and I believe we are in a recession. And we're in a very high inflationary period, but this one is different than ones we've seen in the past because there are jobs available. Now, it may not be the job you'd like to do, but when we're in a tough situation, we have to get over this idea of find free money or something. No, no, what we're gonna do is we're gonna go to work and we're gonna work harder. And it's a great thing to emulate to your children because unfortunately, things are cyclical. And guess what? Your children are gonna watch what you're doing, dad getting a second job, mom getting a second job, creating things, eating home more, getting on a spending plan. They're going to watch you go through this and it's going to help set them up when, for when they have to do it themselves. Because guess what? It's going to come around again. This is not my first recession. It's not my first high inflationary period. And it won't be yours or your children's last one. It's going to happen again. So these are good things to demonstrate. So the first thing is let's look at cash flow coming in and let's look at outgo going out. Let's cancel subscription services. Let's make sure we're spending money wisely. Get the children involved. Many times parents are afraid to talk to the kids about money. The children are so smart. It's a great time for them to learn. Tell them everything's gonna be okay, but explain to them what inflation is. Tell them that the eggs cost more this week. Prices have gone up. Kind of explain it to them and say, so because of that, we're gonna change some things. So it teaches them to do that. So, so the idea of this when, when things are tough is, is make good decisions, but communication is the key. A lot of times there's one person in the family that kind of spearheads the finances, and so they're taking the brunt of it, the pressure of it. Well, share that responsibility. Sit down and have an open discussion. Hey, this is how the numbers look, and we're not good right now, so we're going to figure this out. What can we do? Yard sales, great way to generate extra cash. Clean out the closet, clean out the toy closet, clean out the garage, sell things, get cash, take extra jobs, ask your, this is a great time, especially in, in, in the recession period, to go to your boss and become the most valuable person there. Ask him for extra, what can I do extra, what can I do extra? Because if layoffs happen, you hate to say it this way, but you want it to be to somebody else. <laughs> So become the best employee you can be wherever you're working and your supervisors will appreciate that and maybe they'll look at you last if they have to start making cuts. Yeah.